We may think about where we come from and where we are going. Also, we wonder what the purpose of life is and what we live for. At the same time, we look for a stable job, material affluence, power, and honor. But we feel there is something missing in our life. Why do we wonder about our existence or the purpose of life? Furthermore, why do we yearn for things like the existence of the Creator or the truth, beauty, faith, hope, and love? It is because all human beings are spiritual. As a corporeal beings, we need many things for survival. We need food, clothing, and shelter, and we need money for them. Then we seek out the ability and power to make more money. Yet at the same time, we want to love someone and want to be loved. We desire to have good relationships with many people and want to be recognized. But it is impossible for us to get everything we want. It is frustrating and we have dissatisfaction constantly. Sometimes life seems tough and painful, yet we feel satisfaction for a while in our lives. Sometimes we feel happiness. When a long-awaited wish has come true, when we are recognized, when we fall in love with someone. We hope those moments last forever. However, those moments always end quickly. How is it possible for us to obtain everlasting happiness and satisfaction? Although we do not know how to do that yet, but one thing is clear. That is, there is the deepest desire for eternal happiness within us. We may continue to yearn for it unknowingly. But wait, where does this desire come from? Did it come from me? Is this planted by somebody? Why do we hunger for eternal happiness while chasing earthly pleasure? To this question, the Catholic Church answers, the desire for God is written in the human heart because man is created by God and for God. It means that our longing for eternal happiness is like the desire for God and that desire is written by not ourselves but God. The Catholic Church also teaches, God never ceases to draw man to himself. Only in God will he find the truth and happiness he never stops searching for. It means that the eternal happiness can be found only in God. Aha! That is it! Now you feel everything begins to make sense. There is an endless longing for eternal happiness within us. And God created us, and He wrote the desire for Himself in our hearts. He is drawing and calling us to Himself constantly. And there is no way for us to find this eternal happiness within ourselves. In fact, what we were eagerly looking for, the truth and the eternal happiness, can be found only in God. In this sense, we all came from God and we are returning to God. We may not be fully conscious of that. For us, God is calling us with a longing for Him. In other words, a longing for eternal happiness. He is calling us over and over. Then He says, Everything you are looking for is all in Me. Now the only thing left is our response. Your response.